Hello viewers, today I decided to make an actual history video about Axis activities in the Pacific Ocean. Interesting right? Well I will be mostly talking about U-boats in Dutch East Indies or Indonesia, in the Java Ocean too. They were called Gruppe Monsoon. There were many U-boat types like Type IXD, XIV and IXC, from the website uboatases.com. Here is a route of the U-boats to the far east from Europe. They passed through many naval blockades as in the early periods of war there were not many good anti-submarine methods. Still from the same website here is one moment where a U-boat refueled. It is very dangerous and even at June 1944 the entire U-tanker system was destroyed. But what is the goal of all of this? To help and support their ally Japan. Most of the U-boats came with raw materials for the Japanese in exchange for raw materials by the Japanese which were hard to find in Europe. Many German sailors enjoyed their stay in Java and or Dutch East Indies. Many were stationed there too so they can assist the Japanese at taking care of the U-boats. Everything was going well until the tide of the war creeps on the U-boat groups. First U-boats in the Atlantic were already desperate. Then situation in the ground in Europe is also desperate. Out of 45 U-boats ever sent to Asia, only three fully returned to Germany. Some said that the sailors were too relaxed there to the point that their guard went down sometimes. It is sad for the Germans that they died far away from their homeland. Overall thousands of tons worth materials did got traded by the Japanese and the Germans. Some missions went well actually. But problems like logistic really heckled their goals. Now there is an interesting story too. An Italian submarine named. Commandante Capellini, one of the Italian submarines that made it to Asia was taken by the Germans in Singapore after the Italians surrendered in September 1943. After the Germans surrendered in May 1945 the Japanese took it. After Japan surrendered it was sunk by the Allies because it was used for target practice. Making it the only submarine used by three Axis countries in World War II. This is the book I have which is one of the sources I used for this video, it is interesting but it uses the Indonesian language. Now if I have a mistake please leave a comment. Other sources at the description.